hi guys good afternoon so welcome back to my channel um, I did say that I wanted to make more videos so here they are um, for today um, for this video actually if you can tell by the title um, I'm just going to be talking about the ipsy bag for February and my thoughts on last month's um, January ipsy bag so um, Let's get started with last month's first. Um, just like a little review on it. We received the Pacifica Butter Lotion or Body Butter. And I actually like this. The smell, I mean, I'm not really too fond of the whole citrusy orange um, smell, but this one was actually really good. It's very moisturizing. I like to use it especially like on my elbows and on my knees. My favorite item from a last month's bag had to be the Nail Teeny um, Nail Polish in Frappe. I absolutely love this color. It's like a like a nude pink. Like I even have, my, have it on my nails right now, but it's kind of chipping away. But I get so much compliments on this and it's such a gorgeous color. So Frapp Frappe. Um, that's my favorite um, item. So there was also some Argan Oil by Josie Moran um, in last month's bag. And this I tried using on my face and on my cuticles and on my foot. Um, on my face, I mean, I felt like it did get smoother. Um, but then I kind of stopped using it just because, I don't know, it started feeling kind of weird over here. I don't know if it was due to this. But... Um, after that, I just started using it on my cuticles when I did my nails. And I started using it on my foot because I have very dry feet. So there was also the Big Sexy Hairspray. Um, I only used this once, and this was when I went out with some friends. Um, and I curled my hair and stuff, and I used it. And it actually um, lasted really long. My curls stayed intact, so I was really happy about that. Last product was um, a brush from London Soho. Oh no, from a brush from um, Soho, and I actually received the concealer brush, and I didn't even use it yet, um, just because I have like two other concealer brushes, so I'm just saving this one until my other ones go bad. But so yeah, I can't really give a review on this. That's one. pretty much it for last month's um, January Ipsy bag. For this month, um, February, I was really excited. Oh, and the the purse for last month was actually pretty nice. I mean, the bottom, there's more width here, and then it goes, like, it gets skinny up here. So, another good makeup bag to have. Now, so for February's um, Ipsy bag, um, I kind of was really excited to get the products. So... Um, this is the bag and I'm not too fond of it. It looks very cheap and tacky. It's like a patent little pouch. And then inside is red, you know, Valentine's Day. That's what I think they were going for. And it just says, see? And then with the card, get um, red carpet ready. So a lot of these products were very like glamorous and um, good for I guess, oh yeah, the Grammys were were this month, so I guess it makes sense to have this. But anyway, um, let's see. I actually have most of the, actually all of the products I've used, but I only used it twice. I still need to like give it more a couple more days to try and, and give you guys a full review on it. And that, that won't probably be out till next month, um, till I get March's Ipsy bag. But anyways, um... First off, we get the Pop Beauty Mascara in black. Then we also have the Lash Cards. Um, I honestly thought there was going to be more um, cards in here to use, but they only gave, give you like, let's see, one, two, three, I think they only give you four. Yeah, four, because I just used one today, so this is how how you, you kind of just put it over your eye and apply your mascara. It came with a Coastal Scents quad, so another one. Um, and I mean, I already have like Coastal Scents um, products, so I already know like how it is. I mean, it's very pigmented. And I actually have it on my eyelids right now. 
Um, so it's very like smoky. These colors are called Candlelight, Gunmetal, Incognito, and Ashen. I hope I'm saying that all right. And then I was really excited to get this. I'm always excited to get face primers because only now I'm like just starting to get into the face primer thing. So this one's by Pixie, Flawless and Poreless. And then last but not least, this product um, I was so excited to get only because I was already like dying to buy some gel eyeliner. All my gel liners right now have like dried up. So I've been wanting to get a new one and thank god I didn't buy one because I got one in my Ipsy bag. So this one's by Mika Beauty Cosmetics. And this one's in black. So that's what it looks like. I already tried some and I'm using that right now too. And it goes so smooth on but then again I mean it's, it's new. Every first application it goes on really nice and smooth. Um, lasting power this is my second time using it the first time I used it it actually lasted all day what I did notice was that like when it's in here it kind of like somehow slides and it kind of like gets in this area here so I don't know we'll just see but um I'll give maybe like a more thorough review on it maybe next month or just give a little like say a couple of things about it just like how I said things about um last month's ipsy bag but um I hope you guys found I hope you guys found this video really helpful um please subscribe like comment whatever um and you can also follow me on instagram um I'm under bevy love so that's b-e-v-y-y-l-o-v-e -E. so yeah until the next video, I'll see you guys later. Bye!